Yeah, that's what I take me to. When you focus, you focus you. What's that? When you focus, you focus you. Pretty focused guy. Yeah, I know. Well, you went into the garage, I was right beside you. You never seen me. When I went in the garage? Yeah, you never seen me, I was right beside you. I wave and everything, never seen me. I had the podcast so cranked you, up. You must have been focusing on what you're going to do with those med heads. That's what it was. Uh, you're stuttering. So, <laughs> what's going to happen? The next budget? two weeks. Well, no, in the next two weeks. Uh, is there something going to come out with the issue of uh, Crystal Matt? And we are, uh, you know, I know we've talked before about compassion intervention. You know, about getting people that need help. Yeah. Refuse it. Yeah. So, uh, in jail, I mean, in the courts. Yeah, we got the programming now in the jail that's being rolled out, uh, has been rolled out last fall it started, but it's continuing on this spring. So the object is to have every jail, every correctional facility programming for inmates. So in the courts, a lot of them, they're summoned for their arrest. They don't even bother showing up in court. Mm. And the police don't bother to chase after them. Well, You're the pub Minister of Public Safety. Shouldn't we be concerned about that? So right now, today, we're four, uh, I think it's 4% over capacity in our correctional facilities. So anybody that says, you know, you shouldn't be building jails, no. I would say, okay. So then you're okay with someone that's supposed to be serving 90 days or six months, getting, getting, high, getting let out on house arrest, put an ankle bracelet on them and send them out early, right? So you're over capacity, which is what we had to been doing for the last several years so by building a new jail you don't have to do that anymore if you're sentenced to 90 days you're gonna do your 90 days what's gonna happen this summer it's a major major problem it's a major problem across North America but, everybody is struggling with this but here it's uh, I talked to an airline pilot uh, from Air Canada <coughs> a couple of days ago Tim Morton a young guy anyways a pilot told me when all over the place the bigger the city the bigger is the problem yeah here this is not a city this is a big town right. there's only two streets here yeah. and are we going to change the Mental Health Act, Section 10, that they don't have to be covered by the Mental Health Act, that police can arrest them? Wait and see. What's the matter? Can't get them. I can't a, you tell can't. You. Me, I can't tell you. me and my 26 <laughs> viewers just want. Don't worry about it. Nobody no, listens to this bullshit. It's coming. It's coming. I can tell by your facial expression. Yeah, it's coming. Okay, that's all I got to hear.